back with another spite crazy assault that is what they should call this shit five cuckoos this time fucking cuckoo man now this should be interesting with all the damn uh, tornadoes or whirlwinds or whatever the hell dude get hit with one of those things you are done See we could do though. We got a decent team. I don't know the set. I don't know what the set's gonna do, but he is our only physical damage. So hopefully he can sneak in there and get something done. And we got a cuckoo of our own. And here's this new Hades skin. Ah. Uh, it's all right. It's okay. I don't really. I don't know. I don't care for it too much. I like the purple one with the bones. He's got like the bone face. This one has a bone face too, but he's like an Egyptian dude, like a pharaoh. A pharaoh! Eat me! Oh, how dare you! We got a tier 5 skin out there, Cuckoo. Fuck you talking about, Set? Oh, shit! Alright, uh, I don't know what that's- Oh, come on, I just fucking got up in there, dude. Damn, I'm dumb. Damn, I'm dumb. No! Alright. Multi cuckoos is no joke. Are we about to get ripped again? Oh my goodness, Hades is just blinking in there. Help this man! Help this man! Oh my goodness, Set! Who else is blinking in there? Y'all motherfuckers is crazy! Maybe that's the only way to get to these dudes, though, is with a little blink action. Oh, Set didn't even blink. I guess Set has his own thing going on. I really need boots. Movement speed is going to be key in this matchup. This shit getting wild. We got heals though. One good thing we got going for us. So I'm gonna get some boots. I'm gonna get a gem. We're gonna try to slow this game down a little bit. Oh my goodness, Hades though. He's getting. He doesn't have health. He's just bum rushing in there. Well, too late on that. Sorry. Yeah, we just gotta defend, really. Look at all these damn cuckoos! All right, Seth, you get it. You go, boy.
Y'all getting shitted out. Never mind. Cancel that. Cancel that. Whoa! Daddy Cuckoo just came home. Get some boots, and then we'll get the gem next. Let's see if we can get this chalice. So, they could change this to be a little bit better, I think. And if they were going to do ranked, like a ranked assault, where it was kind of like this, it wasn't random, you could pick. They should make it where you can't have doubles. Just have it like ranked, you know what I'm saying? You pick a dude, and he's just grayed out. No one else can pick him. It would be even cool if nobody on the other team could pick him either. That would be hot shit. What is Hayden doing? Ah, hug the wall, baby. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, too late again, man. Get out of here, bro. Oh, revenge! Flippity jippity bit. I'll light you up. Right, let's work on this damn gem. It's a gem. So I'm on library too, man. Library seems like it's a good platform. But I'm going to tweet at him because uh, I'm a little worried about, like, email address. It's with, uh, with Steam, you have, like, a, a key, a string of letters and numbers, case sensitive, all this shit. And it's, like, you know, a private key, like a, like a Bitcoin or any crypto. But with library, it's, like, they can read, they reset your password or I don't even think they reset shit they just log in by email somehow right, these cuckoos are straight owning us so I'm worried about that a little bit because your email can get compromised and then you lose your whole shit like if you're investing in library someone just get your email address you know that's a big problem oh yeah we're dead oh yeah so I do like library I think it's pretty cool and I think it's gonna be really similar to k.im with that kim.com dude he's gonna come out with something this year 2020 uh, what am I doing getting heavenly wings hells to the no going with Aegis, baby. Aegis! Alright, so we're getting shitted on. Two games in a row here. We just had a new wild game when we got ripped. Ripped! Now, we're getting destroyed with Poseidon. Sometimes you get games like that, man. You know what I'm saying? Just gotta have fun and make a video. Make a video about it. Think about better times. Think about life. Think about inflation. You know, you got a mortgage. Oh, fuck these dudes. They're going for it. They're going for it. I don't think so, bro. Inflation is going to go up. Your house. 
It's going to fucking triple in price. People don't believe it, but... Ooh! Another cuckoo! No, the cuckoos, yo. Yo, cuckoo! What's you doing, bruh? Yo, cuckoo, what you doing, bruh? Oh. You know, inflation's gonna go way up. Way to fuck up, in my opinion. Homes are gonna quadruple. So if you got a $200,000 house, well, you can just consider that shit is gonna be fucking $800,000. What am I talking? Time frame? 10 years? 2030? There's a dude on YouTube, too. He hasn't posted in a few years, but he's good, man. I would definitely recommend everybody look him up. His name is Mr. Alan Kendall. Talks about supply and demand, history, house pricing, you know, all types of shit. Really smart dude. Makes sense. You know, nobody knows. You know, I'm saying all this shit, but nobody fucking knows. That's why, you know, you never listen to anybody as far as, oh, that's going to happen. He said so. You know, you don't like want to get into like some cult shit like that. But you do want to take people's information. Fuck you! Get out of here! No! I hear Cuckoo! I hear the dragon. Damn, I missed with that be. Yeah, I'll say yes to that. I'll say yes to that, bruh. You don't want to listen to people, but, you know, you want to take information, you know, and think about it. Be like, okay, think for yourself. Like, all right, he's saying this. Does that make sense? Let me think about it. And do your own research, you know? And try to figure shit out. Well, we will end it on that note. So that's what I try to do, man. You know, it just makes sense with the Federal Reserve and the U.S. printing all these dollars. Shit's going to go up. It's already happened. You know, I've already seen it happen in the 90s or the 80s, whenever the fuck it was. Houses were going for way cheaper. You know, you'd have to look it up. I forget what it was. Houses were going for way cheaper. Then in 2006, they like peaked up. My father-in-law bought a house for $30,000 40 years ago. So that was 80. So 40 years ago, $30,000 home. That was 1980. $30,000 he bought his house for. Guess what that house was worth in 2006? $200,000. So the fucking house, what did it do? Two, four, six, eight, ten, ten 10 times over? I mean, what the fuck? Right? No, that, that would have been 20 grand. So 3,000. So six times over. Almost seven times over. It already happened. This is what happens. This is the shit that happens. You know, it's kind of like with the Bitcoin, too. It's the same mentality. Like, look, the shit already went from fucking 200 bucks to 20 grand. Now, past performance isn't indicative of future results or whatever the hell they're saying is you know that's right it doesn't guarantee it but when all the things are still in place when the federal reserve is still printing money like crazy it just makes sense that assets are going to go up against the dollar when everything's valued in the dollar things are going to go the fuck up as long as bitcoin doesn't get hacked obviously if bitcoin doesn't get hacked through the roof man through the roof catch you on the next one later